Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We are taking a look at the best B plus off-road adventure. I'm calling this the Winnebago Echo Killer. This is a beast of a tiny motorhome. This is a 2023 Coachman Cross Trail Model 20XG all-wheel drive with the Extreme Package. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first and the inside features. Then we're gonna give you three things we love about this motorhome and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video. Again today, I am super excited to be taking a look. Look at that motorhome. Is that not awesome and badass? Now before we show everybody, we do gotta say hi to Andrea. Hey Andrea! Hi everyone! How's it going today? It's going good you guys. This is really exciting, Matt. That does look like an off-road beast. Yes it look is. Look the front grill. It looks absolutely fantastic. And why are we here in Texas, Andrea? We are here in Texas, you guys. There is so much new inventory here. We're super excited. There is a special we want to tell you about. Yes, the 43 days of $43 million in savings from, with uh, motorhome specialists and NASCAR. Guys, they are giving away a VIP experience to the race. The sale ends September 10th. They're giving away tickets to the race September 25th four tickets to the texas motor speedway and a chance to meet petty driver eric jones the sale ends september 10th so if you guys are looking to buy a 2022 or 2023 motorhome specialist has amazing sale prices and if you come in before september 10th no purchase necessary you enter to win the um you okay so i think it was a red ant or something oh no on my ankle. sorry Here, guys go go check yourself enter to win um, no purchase necessary. All you gotta do is come into Motorhome Specialist and tell them that you want to enter. And the Motorhome Specialist will be giving away the prize on September 10th. Andrea, without further ado, let's begin. Look at this. Look at this beast. Wow. This is the Coachman Cross Trail Andrea 20XG. The actual tip tip length is 24 feet. This is powered. This has the V6 EcoBoost, 3.5 liter EcoBoost V6 Turbo. 306 horsepower, 400 pound feet of torque. This is the Ford Transit all wheel drive. And again, it has the extreme package, which looks absolutely awesome. Look at this front grill guard. I love this. You have the LED lights and everything. The Transit is such a nice, easy driving motorhome. I'm telling you, it drives just like a Mercedes. It's fantastic. Coming on down the side here, no bunk over the cab really it's a seamless look that's why people call this a b plus and andrea this unit came out before the winnebago echo but the winnebago echo was made to be the off-terrain look and this they're saying okay we see you and then we raise you i mean this is awesome look at these tires Andrea. they're the firestones i love those they're the Transforce AT2s. Look at those rims. LT225-75 R16. And yes, Andrea, those some nice looking rims. It's really good. It's a nice look. EcoBoost all-wheel drive. Very nice. I like the orange color because that's my of color. Of course you do. <laughs> right here, we do have the uh, running boards to get in on the inside. Okay. Very nice. Easy to get in. Very small and sleek motorhome. You got mirrors right here, and you do have side cameras right there, Andrea. Coming on down, we do have very nice power awnings with LED lights. And take a look at that Class C right there. You see how the RV part's like a box? Yes. Well, this is going to be more rounded off with more curvature. Gives it a sleeker look. This is just like driving a regular vehicle. Because this is Coachman, Andrea, they do use Asdell for their fiberglass. Asdell is a green-based material that will never delaminate on you. Very nice power awning with LED lights. Little solar right there. And then here, Andrea, is your propane tanks. And we'll put all the specs of this motorhome here. Bing! For everybody who's watching on television. Now, Andrea, you hear the engine? Yes. Do you hear the generator? Uh, tiny bit, not really. No, you don't hear it at all. Oh. Because there is no generator because this unit runs completely off lithium-ion batteries. Wow. And everything's lit up and the AC's working just off the batteries, which is pretty impressive. Right here we do have a hookup for TV on the outside. 
and then check this out propane quick connect if you want to have a grill on the outside and then andrea look at this oh beast oh my goodness this is like a toy hauler bring your bikes your kayaks your doll crates anything everything wow. you have this nice diamond plate right here d-rings to tie down your expensive toys very very nice and then andrea what's really cool jen and i actually reviewed this unit back in 2019 when it first came out and um the bed was right here and you need a ladder to get I on remember the bed that. we recommended that they made it a toy hauler and now they do yes very that, cool. that would have been hard for a lot of people to get into it was but i'm glad they did that coming around the back dang nab but andrea no ladder to get up on the roof we do have a nice bumper for your stinky slinky this hitch is four thousand pound hitch don't tow four thousand pounds behind this um always know before you tow this is going to be good for like people that want to bring like a little six by 12 behind them and then right there you do have the backup camera right there but i do like the bumper for your stinky slinky over here andrea this is just the other side of that massive storage i can't get enough of that right there that's where you're dumping your tanks black and gray tanks and then here's your city water outlet and everything outdoor city water outlet your fills black tank flush potable water fill potable potable very nice right here's your water heater i wish they would have made that gray um 30 amp service here Ooh, nice battery bay look at those batteries on a mori tray yes ma'am very nice and then here that's interesting what is that i don't know nothing <laughs> nothing's there well, Andrea, the outside of this motorhome looks great, but the it's not just the outside. The inside looks absolutely fantastic as well. Let's go take a look. All right, cargo carrying capacity. Check it out. Uh-oh, might be on the inside of the door. Oh, there it is. All right, guys. Oh, yeah, there's no slides in this. 2,248 pounds. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay, no slides in this. This is nice. What you see is what you get. Nice walkway, plenty of space. Here is your shower, your bed, your garage, and your bathroom. And Andrea, we're actually going to mix it up. We're going to start back there. But before we do, let's give a big shout out to RV Life. Matt's RV Reviews is proudly sponsored by RV Life. Tools that make camping simple. Everybody knows when it comes to camping, it can be a little stressful, but not with RV Life. So first, discover, research campgrounds and other locations of interest with detailed information, but for RVers. Plan your trip accordingly with the popular trip planner. That software is amazing. It's going to tell you the best routes and you can go with your RV safe GPS. Not only are you typing in your specifications so it knows not to take you under any low bridges, but you can actually use that offline. So so if you're at a place with no Wi-Fi, you'll still have your GPS and you can share it with their RV community, guys. RV Life is more than just an app. It's an awesome program that all RVers should have. What we're doing is a free seven-day trial for Matt's RV Reviews customers and 25% off on top of that. So all you do is go to their website, rvlife.com, sign up for the free seven-day trial by clicking our link down below or typing in Matt's RV Reviews. Don't download the app because you, then you won't get the free seven days. So do it on the website, register Matt's RV Reviews, then download the app. We appreciate RV Life for sponsoring this video and sponsoring Matt's RV Reviews. Let's continue the video. All right, Andrea, again, we are mixing things up today. So let's begin back here again. Look how cool this is. This is your garage area and you can access it from the main size of your RV. I'm about 5'4", five, 5'5", five, five. so this is about 4'10", you know what I'm saying? Maybe maybe 5 feet that you can actually stand back here. You got power and everything. This is so nice. And then, per our recommendations, look at this, 800 pounds. Oh, <laughs> Maybe let's get it up a little bit. Oh, there must be a lock mechanism. But Andrea, look at this. This is the bed up here. 800 pounds in the bed. 
very, very nice. Wow. What do you think of it? I think it's pretty cool. Now it is small and it is tight, Andre, but again, that's what this motorhome is. This is truly a B plus. And then over here, I'm in the shower. This is the same shower as ours, Andrea. This is the same shower as ours. We have a 32 foot motorhome. This is only 24 foot in the same size shower. Really nice, gets the job done and everything. And then over here, very nice. Hey, we've got a cabinet wardrobe actually right okay. here. Okay, very nice. And then a little bit right down here. And then above the toilet, we have more storage. Nice. And then the little sink area. And then over here, Andrea, plastic toilet. <sighs> Andrea, this is not a prime poop position. But here's what I will say. When you compare this to other B's and B pluses on the market, it actually, it's a better leg space than our bathroom. It you know is, what I'm saying? it is. Like this is how they should have laid out our bathroom, to be honest with you. Andrea, show everybody this kitchen. Okay, guys, look at this. This is very interesting. We got some storage above. Okay. Nice window. Two burner propane cooktop, Dometic. Very nice. So, oh, that's nice. Look at that. I like that. Three. Show, yeah, show all three for us, please. Three drawers. Very nice. Okay. And then above here. Oh, I did show this one, didn't it's I? It's okay. We got a sink here and then some more storage. Nice. And then behind me, we've got pantry space. All right. Wow. Hang on. Let me show all of it. Wow, it goes all the way down Definitely to the bottom. Definitely more than a class B for sure. Yes. Yes, for sure. Okay. Over here, we have the Magic Chef microwave. Ooh, Magic Chef. This I always think is a little weird. Why is that? I don't know. It's just so high up. And it I is. know some people like it. I think it's strange. We've got a Dometic. But Andrea, wait. Think about this. <laughs> That's just uh, how I eat my food. A Dometic refrigerator it runs so off your three-way fridge. Three-way. Yep. So it, it runs on propane as well. Yep, propane, battery, and electric. Okay. Very nice. And a little freezer. But I mean, this unit doesn't have propane, so it this must. Do, this does have propane. Oh, we saw propane. Did we? America, it's so hot. Yeah, I'll, we're getting delirious. I'm losing my brain cells. Okay. We have to check on that. If now. it does have propane, then it does, and if it doesn't, then it doesn't. <laughs> oh my goodness! All right, Andre. Nice. It doesn't matter if it has propane or not. However, you want to use this fridge, it just works. That's right. Storage above. Nice storage above. Dinette. It does have well. propane. It does. It just doesn't have um generator. And we have. Oh, I forgot. Yeah. Yes. This is the daytime and nighttime shade. Yes. Oh, I love that. I do. I like this a lot. And then you can have those windows all the way open like that. Yeah. Which is very nice. And then here, Miss Andrea, chilling at the dinette. And I can tell already they made this dinette bigger. This was just a two seater. Really, really like this and appreciate this. This dinette does drop down to make a bed in Andrea. Yes. Even though there's no color uh, balances in here, how do you like the color scheme in here? I like it. I like it too. I think it's very, very nice. Um, notice the heat duct on the side as well, which is cool. Yes. And let's see if there is storage underneath this dinette. Uh, no, there's not. All right. But again, this does drop down if you need another sleeping area. And then above here, Miss Andrea, we Got do have, cubbies. yep, right there and here, TV right there. And Andrea, before we show everybody the cockpit area, do you know what time it is? It's now time for the MSRP. Andrea, we're crushing through this very, really quick. MSRP on this motorhome is $145,490, Andrea. MSRP. Currently, we have it on sale for $116,999. And Andre, if you're interested in this motorhome, please reach out to us, mattsrvreviews.com, fill out the contact tab. We are going to make sure that you guys get a great price, great service, and the best overall buying experience in the industry. Now, Andre, before we show everybody the cockpit area, um, I want to show everybody this. We got GFI power, USB, 
solar controls. Look at this. This is your Renault G battery monitors. This is what you're getting when you don't get the propane. Very nice. Power awning buttons and everything. This is what, guys, the AC and everything's running off the batteries. Absolutely amazing. Did I show that TV? Yes. Okay. And then we had the low light switch there. And then Andrea, come on in here. All right, this is the nice, this is the nice transit chassis. We got power, look at this. Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, very big screen right there. Everything that you want, navigation, audio. Right here's the camera screen. I can see all three cameras at one time if I want. Right here we have power windows. I got a cup holder right here. Andrea, how do you feel right there? Feels nice, you know, it's, it is amazing when you get in these, how comfortable they are. They're not intimidating at all. It honestly does feel like you're driving a regular vehicle and it's a very, very smooth ride. Andrea, I must not concur with you. I would not say it's like driving a regular vehicle. I mean, you said that when, say, oh. It's like driving an off-road vehicle, you know, Andrea? Oh yeah, that's we're right. We're driving it. Oh goodness, oh, man. we're Look going, we're going. Look at this, this is just cool and badass. It's American. It's okay. Andrea's pointing at stuff. I just want to take it just for a quick lap, Andrea. Look at this. Is this not awesome? It is. Oh man, look at all these motorhomes we're going to be reviewing soon. Very nice, Andrea. It's easy to drive, easy to turn. And let me tell you, we're on some rough terrain right now with these rocks. Andrea, this is a nice, smooth ride. It really is. It's this, driving better than the Suburban we're in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and, um, and Andrea, there's a new Thor Pasadena that we're going to be reviewing in a few days here on the show. But, Andrea, this is just an awesome unit and easy to drive. This is perfect for the person who loves to go to state and national parks. You know what I'm saying? This is for the person that likes to off-grid. Absolutely. freaking lovely Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Now, before everybody leaves, it's time we give you three things we love about this unit and three things we dislike about it. Andrea, what do we do first? Uh, let's do three things we dislike about it. First? First. You, uh, you must go first. Up, oh, you're shaking your head no. Find something, Andrea. I, do, I don't like that placement of the refrigerator. Well, well, stand up there and, well, and explain to us. I think Andrea, it's Andrea, Andrea, you got to say the whole script. You ready? Okay. Dislike number one. All right, dislike number one. I already said it before when I've been in cross tracks and they have this weird setup. I don't like it. I think it takes up a lot of space. I think they could have done a better job and put this somewhere else. Andre, that's dislike number one. You ready for me? Sure. Dislike number two. I'm going back here. I'm going to say I don't like this. Um, with this motorhome, I would much rather prefer an induction cook top. Uh, I think it would look better and everything and it just kind of is what it is. Um, that's dislike number two. And then Andrea. Dislike number three. Tink, tink, tink. What could dislike number three be? No convection microwave. Well, call me Sally, Andrea. <laughs> no convection microwave? No, Sally. No oven, no convection microwave. Andrea. That is a wonderful number three. I can't believe they did that. Um, but at least you do have a propane cooktop or propane quick connect on the outside to hook up a grill. But that doesn't bake cookies or pizzas or anything you want to throw in an oven. DiGiorno what to tell you. I don't, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I guess you're not putting any DiGiornos in that freezer. Andrea, that's three things we dislike about it. Now it's time for three things we like about it. Andrea, you go first. Okay, just uh, like number one, you guys. Are we on dislikes? We're on likes, yes. Oh, sorry. It's really the heat. Sorry, guys. I love, love, love this setup here with the blinds. The windows, the blinds, yeah, the I dinette. Just, I wish I would see that more, you know, and you don't have like some tacky balances. It's just very plain. Yes, not only that, Andre, clean. drop that down. Very plain, clean, and just. I love the modern. daytime blinds and then put, put the yeah. privacy blinds all the way up. Bada bing, bada boom. Bada bing, bada boom. And not only that, to get a nice big size dinette is really awesome. That is number one. Andrea, number two and three, we're going outside. 
Actually, I'm gonna give you two, three, and four. Number two, Andrea, I love this extreme package. I love the tires, I love that front grille. I love the all-wheel drive. I love how this was made for the outdoorsman. Number three, Andrea, I love how this is running off the lithium-ion batteries, which is super nice. No generator on this coach. Runs completely off solar. And then Andrea, number four, you know we saved the best for last. Love, love, love this bed slash garage area. I love how the bed goes up and down. I love how you can bring your toys with you and it raises up. And I love how you have the D-rings and tie downs, making this a fantastic motorhome. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are interested in this motorhome, please go to the website, mattsrvreviews.com, fill out the contact tab. We're gonna make sure that we get you guys a great price, great service, and the best RV buying experience in the industry. Andrea, anything you want to say? Yes, let me get out of the sun. Yes, ma'am. Hey, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things you dislike. Coachman does read the comments and they do watch the videos. Yes. And we are interested to see what you have to say about this one. Yes. Thanks, you, thanks so much for watching, you guys. We hope you're safe and well. Thank you absolutely everybody so much for watching. And Andrea, we'll, we'll see, see you next time. time.